this is absolutely my new favorite rifle. Uh, we're calling this the 98B Fieldcraft. But we've taken that platform and we've kind of optimized it for weight. So what we're doing is uh, really blurring the lines between a tactical precision rifle and a hunting rifle. The rifle has got a lighter contour barrel than like what we run on the MRADs or the normal 98Bs. So we've gone with a, a smaller contour barrel which really got weight off the front of the gun. The forearm is greatly slimmed down. We've added key mod cuts to the front. Uh, the forearm is quite a bit thinner as well. From the old 98B, what is, one thing that has changed is we've now added a Picatinny rail at the rear instead of the monopod socket. So now you can have a monopod of your choice at the rear. You know, this is not a folding stock on this rifle, and I love that. For people that don't need a folding stock, this is exactly what you want. I think it's going to see a lot of use with the um, long-range competitive shooters, high-speed competitions, because this is a gun you want to carry. It's a gun you want to carry and you want to shoot. The 98B Fieldcraft, along with really all of our other platforms, are now available in many colors. This one is burnt bronze, which is exclusive to the Fieldcraft. We're also chambering the rifle now in some calibers that we haven't seen the 98B in before. Instead of just 338 Lapua Magnum, which we still have, we also have 300 Win Mag, 7 millimeter Rim Mag. That's kind of a new one in the barrel lineup. 308 and 260 Remington and 65 Creedmoor. The magic thing about this rifle is the way you interface with this gun. It's, uh, it is not big and bulky. And one of the misconceptions about a precision rifle is that it has to be. When you get into the right position to take a shot, whether you're in a combat situation or you're stalking on an animal, I can almost guarantee you when you get there, there's not gonna be a bench rest set up for you to shoot off of. And you're probably not gonna be able to get into that ideal prone position either. And that's where this rifle really shines. It's the, the small contour of the forearm, the way the stock works for you, the pistol grip, the position of the selector, the way that the bolt handle is easy to actuate. When you have to fire this gun from actual field positions, your hit probability is so good with this rifle. And that's just something that's kind of hard to explain on paper or in an image. You really have to shoot it and fill the rifle to, to see. 1998 was the year we first started working on 338 Lapua Magnums. I developed a semi-automatic rifle, and then later when we came back to the drawing board and said we need a bolt-action rifle now, it was way after 1998, we said what are we going to call it? We said well the 338 program was in 1998, we revived the model 98 number, but we stuck a B on the end of it, so it's 98B. A lot of people do ask that, so there it is, so we've got that now. So.